हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई नो दीज फोर डेज बिफोर नीट ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव मस्ट बी चैलेंजिंग मेनी ऑफ यू फील डिप्रेस्ड एंडशियस एंड सम ऑफ यू माई हैव फील डीमोटिवेटेड ऑल्सो बिकॉज ऑफ द बार्क टेस्ट और द ग्रैंड टेस्ट यू हैव रिटर्न राइट बट डोंट गिव अप प्लीज डोंट गिव अप ओके सो दीज फोर डेज इफ यू study good if you cover the right strategy you can ace neat examination okay because nta follows certain patterns okay when they are asking questions they will follow certain pattern these are important topics that are repeated year after year so i just curated some of the topics for you for this four day strategy so where you can focus on those concepts only to score more marks in your chemistry okay today i'll share these crucial topic with you but i need you you to promise that you won't waste these final 4 days feeling sad or feeling demotivated or stressed or anything promise me that you will focus on mastering every topic i mention here these are the most important topic okay and you can't afford to skip any of them right so let's get started these are the topics are important in case of chemistry in this chapter also i'm going to give you the important topic okay let's get started with one by one first inorganic chemistry chemical bonding the basics are important okay so chemical bonding in case of chemical bonding they will definitely ask question about hybridization right shape and structure of the compounds then focusing on molecular orbital theory bond order which is related to bond strength right and the bond length correct and magnetic character whether it is paramagnetic or diamagnetic cool then most importantly you have to focus here on dipole moment as well dipole moment is important in case of chemical bonding chapter they will ask you the simple questions whether uh, mu is equal to 0 or not okay so if you are planning to skip the hybridization don't do the stand up okay just a dipole moment whether that is mu is equal to dipole moment is equal to zero or not that kind of questions only they will ask because you very well know about the shape and geometry of the given molecule okay the second thing that is coordination chemistry where you are going to focus on valence bond theory questions they will ask you about hybridization again hybridization of the complexes and crystal field theory there you can focus on um spectrochemical series learn it thoroughly like which is weak field ligand which is strong field ligand which are neutral ligand right so just to know what are the spectrochemical series ligands are there okay and the questions can be asked from cfsc and previous year two three question papers or they are not asking much about t2g and eg and all but they will definitely ask you about the magnetic moment okay so magnetic moment related questions are very important and also color of the complex that ncrt chart ncrt table just to memorize that okay from color you can expect a question this year in case of coordination chemistry that's it if you want more just go with the nomenclature okay then block chemistry in case of p d and f block don't do s block elements please don't do s block elements you are expecting out of syllabus question no right so don't do s block element just to do p d and f block elements so there also in f block p block elements 
we are going to focus on ionization enthalpy and atomic radius or ionic radius similarly group 14 ionization enthalpy ionic or atomic radius in case of group 15 only you are going to concentrate hydrides their thermal stability acidity and basicity melting and boiling point trends okay so please concentrate on that that only that trends only and electronegativity electron gain enthalpies of group 16 and 17 okay so if you are going to concentrate on oxidation states so I'm writing it here if you want to you need to concentrate on oxidation states okay the stability of lower oxidation states what are they and um, particularly from d and f block elements and how it decreases increases in the mock test question paper also we have seen some of the questions from oxidation state isn't it and questions about oxidizing and reducing property which is very related to oxidation state okay cool and in case of d and f block KMnO4 and K2Cr2O7. What they will do? What is the oxidizing nature and the reactions in different media? In alkaline medium, how the reaction happens? What is the oxidation state? In acidic medium, how it changes? Okay. And don't forget about lanthanide electronic configuration, especially gadolinium, terbium cerium and europium okay and don't skip the phosphorus oxo acids and sulfur oxo acids if possible please do that also okay if possible otherwise these are only the important topics you need to concentrate on okay moving on to physical chemistry the first topic that is thermodynamics the first law of thermodynamics just uh, delta u which is equal to q plus w the sign conventions, how, how it changes from different physical conditions, right? And relationship between delta U and delta H, delta U which is equal to QV, delta H which is equal to QP. So the, concentrate on those formulas. We already gave you the formula sh sheet for each and every topic. You can download it also or, or else if you have the notes, in your hand please go through it and heat capacity cp cv calculations how it is related r is equal to cp minus cv okay then uh, degrees of freedom for linear and non-linear state and path functions in case of work then the formula is related to adiabatic reversible and irreversible processes the most importantly isothermal reversible and irreversible processes you have to concentrate on then gibbs hemholtz equation uh, concentrate on the spontaneity of the reactions where it changes okay spontaneity of s g and h these three are super important then equilibrium in case of equilibrium, you, you are going to concentrate on Kp, Kc, the relationship between Kp and Kc and lee chatelier principle, how it affects. We know concentration, temperature, pressure. No inert gases, no catalyst. Okay. They will ask you questions related to that. What will happen to exothermic, what will happen to endothermic reactions. Okay. And then ionic equilibrium. KSP on solubility, how to find KSP and S yes values. Common ion effect and that charge, you know, we charged in the crash course as well for the different formulas for strong acids, weak acids and the buffer. The, the three formulas related to that. Okay, just to concentrate on those only buffer solution, salt hydrolysis and pH of course this formula you already know okay then atomic structure Bohr model the formulas for radius and velocity 
energy only concentrate on this okay and then redback's equation i'm writing it here redback equation just know that formula and lyman balmer series what are that and what which re, which region that is happening okay then most importantly quantum numbers what are that what is the significance and how you can find that very very simple we already dealt with this right then chemical kinetics half life equations and reaction orders more specially zero first order that's it okay then first order is super important you should not skip this part and arrhenius equation the how the numerical problem you have to solve and the uh, equation for that with the temperature coefficient then the solution solution nothing is there just we have qualitative properties the four properties right the formulas related to it elevation in boiling point depression in freezing point osmotic pressure and uh vapor pressure lowering of vapor pressure isn't it and for um henry's and raul's law two formulas we have other than this want of factor you are just going to put i over there and for i we have association dissociation formula just you have uh, 4 plus 2 6 6 plus 2 8 formulas only in case of solution chapter right very 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 simple chapter and if you want you can concentrate on positive and negative deviations that is priority 2 first to concentrate on this and then you can go for positive and negative deviations increased pressure minimum boiling as you throw maximum boiling as you throw and uh, what happens to the negative deviations okay so among these eight formulas also the qualitative properties formulas are important after that rawls then hendrix okay then the next important chapter that is electrochemistry just concentrate on nernst equation this is super important then conversion of delta g formulas okay delta g formulas and the relationship between delta g and k which is uh, minus delta g is equal to rt ln k you know that formula right and the conductance formulas cold rosh law formulas of conductance resistivity and conductivity faraday's law okay so these thing you are going to concentrate on this electrochemistry part then at least to know the faraday's the two laws okay laws and formulas related to that okay then don't skip the biomolecules chapter here you can concentrate on glycosidic linkages amino acids that uh, what are the types of amino acids and dna formations which is super important and you can concentrate on glucose fructose structure part okay so that is important in biomolecules then moving to organic chemistry understand how the bonding happens aromaticity resonance um hyperconjugation and inductive effect okay hyperconjugation and inductive i told you rohit will help you here okay right people who have already watched our video very well know about rohit isn't it then um stability of the intermediate type of question which is related to uh, this electronic effects you can expect electronic if not only the electronic effects the aromaticity also okay stability of intermediates it's also super important then isomerism part and structural and stereo isomers how you can find it just Ge geometrical isomer is super important here cis and trans e and z right so those are super important and stereo isomerism part just uh do with the 
2 to the power n for the chiral center. If you want more, more in detail, um, E and Z, if you are a bit confused about that, you can skip it for now. Uh, if you are studying it for first time, you can skip E and Z and R and, R and S. Okay, if you are finding it hard. But please do concentrate on cis and trans and whether it will exhibit geometrical isomerism or not. That type of questions also you can expect. Okay, and then uh, meta ortho para directing groups. How that works? Rearrangement of carbocations and tautomerism. That uh, those simple parts you can do. Name reactions. I am giving you the named reactions. These are super important. Aldol condensation, Friedel-Craft reactions, and then Canisaro, Etat, Rheumatamen. Okay. Then HPZ, Woods, the related to Woods, Woods, Woods fitting, fitting those parts and trial graft I already told you, trial graft, alkylation and acylation both. Then Clemenson, Wolf Kishner, I'm writing it in the order of they are related to each other. Okay. So it is easier you to remember it. Clemenson and Wolf Kishner. Gabriel Thalamide, okay, then Filkinston, Swartz, these are super important, then Dow's process we know for the preparation of, for the preparation of uh, benzene, uh, sorry, phenol, then cumin process, Ball scheme and carbilement reaction. I am attaching this sheet in the description. Please do check it out. Okay, ma'am. I am not having any time to uh, do that again and again. Just uh, have it as a checklist. Okay, this reaction I know. This reaction I know. Do it in the in your mind. Okay, Gatterman, Sandmeyer, Gatterman, Gauche, Halfman, Williamson synthesis, and then important reagent and test in case of. The distinguishing test or those are super important. Hinsberg test, Lucas test, Wellings and Tollins, iodoform reaction, and then nitrous acid, then Grignoid reaction. These are super important, and you can't sp uh, skip the ele arom uh, electrophilic aromatic substitution part, nitration, sulfonation, how it happens. Okay, and my, what are mild and strong oxidizing agents while well, oxidizing the primary, secondary and tertiary amines, amines what will, uh, alcohols what will happen and um, dehydrating agents, bromination agent what will happen and then KOH in aqueous and alcoholic how it differs. Aqueous means it will undergo substitution, alcoholic means elimination it will go, right. So those parts are important, lithium aluminum hydride and sodium borohydride which will reduce what? So that uh, distinguishing part also important, okay? So I'm attaching the sheet over here for as your checklist. Please don't worry, but keep motivating yourself. You are going to rock it, no problem. Just put it in the comments, you are accepting the challenge or not. Okay, just accept the challenge. Do your best. You will do your best. Okay, at least take one practice test. If you want, just make me practice test in your in the description or come uh, in the comment section. I will send you one practice test along with the bubble sheet. Okay, so you can do the practice over there, but please. Be motivated, please ask your questions and this is your four days challenge. You are going to rock it, please remember that. If you want anything, any doubts, put it in the comment. Right? All the best for your examination. Thank you.